Good morning. I'm out. I'm back out here in my shop this morning. It's uh, October 26, and it's uh, a really cool morning out here in uh, the Atlanta area. Um, got down to around freezing, I think. So we had a little frost on the pumpkin uh, this morning. But anyway, I'm out here. I'm going to finish up uh, shooting a video on the the drum sander build that I'm that I'm working on. I started that the other weekend and uh, I'm going to try to get that finished up this weekend or at least uh, get a video uploaded on that. But I wanted to take a minute to show you some of the cool tools that I've uh, acquired over the last week or so. Uh, I went to uh, my local Ace Hardware uh, to buy some uh, nuts and bolts and stuff like that for this, uh, for this uh, drum sander table. And uh, I ran across this in the aisle. They had some of these in there. Uh, this is a Craftsman 6 horsepower, 16 gallon uh, wet dry vac. And it was like $69.99 or something like that. And I thought, man, that, that sounds like a good deal. So I picked one up. Um, I haven't even used this one yet. It's already got a little dusty just from sitting out here. But my, I think what I'm going to try to do is, uh, you know, I'm getting tired of breathing dust out here. So I think I'm, I'm going to try to use this uh kind of keep it stationary over there in the corner and buy one of those uh dust deputies I've, I've watched a lot of videos on those and those things seem like those are awesome uh so i want to use one of those and then run some pvc and uh, run some dust collection uh to my different things i got my band saw right there miter saw over here table saw back here uh router table over here so don't really have that much and plus it should be fairly easy because my shop building is like 12 by 28 so it's pretty much a straight shot if I just run it and then shoot a few, le uh, shoot a few legs off uh, to the left and right and I think that may work so uh, if anybody's got any experience in doing that and if you think this would work or won't work uh, I appreciate your comments let me know but that's what I'm going to try to do is use this along with a uh, dust deputy and then run the PVC up there to uh, create some dust collection in here. I just, I just, everything gets dusty. I mean, you can see even this, I haven't even used it, just got dust on it. So anyway, just wanted to show you that real quick. And after that, maybe I can retire this thing. This has been an old uh, shop vac, a six gallon, three horsepower. This thing has been a real workhorse. Uh, you can see it's uh, really, really filthy, it's dusty. Uh, the filters, uh, you know, since I'm not running any kind of cyclone or anything, the filters get packed full of stuff, especially when I'm using it on my uh, CNC router. I connect it up to that and use a little dust to it. So that thing will get packed, and I'll just take the filter out, take it outside, bang it up against the tree, knock the dust out, put it back in, and the thing just keeps going and going. So uh, this thing is probably over 10 years old, but uh, I'll just keep using it too uh, until until it finally quits completely. Okay, some other stuff I, I was going to uh, talk about. I went to uh, my local Lowe's Home Improvement Center the other day. That's where I do most of my shopping for materials and uh, some things. You know, if I want hardware, I'll run down to my local Ace. But most of the time, I go to Lowe's. Well, I needed a uh, a new tape measure. My old one had. You know how sometimes these things will get kind of brittle and. They'll start getting that split in them and everything. So I needed a new one, so I thought, okay, I'm going to run the lows and get a new tape measure, uh, which I did. But also, when you go in lows, you know, it's hard to come out of there with just, uh, or at least for me it is, hard to come out of there with just one thing. I think this was like, I don't know, 10, 12 bucks or something. It's a uh, Lufkin, Lufkin, however you say it, 25 footer. It's got the uh, self centering, so which is kind of neat. I, I had never had one like this, but I'm going to try it. Uh, so everywhere your uh, dimension is, you look on the other side, and it gives you exactly what half of that is, so to help you center things up. And since I use a tape measure a lot to determine the center point on a, uh, a blank that I'm putting on my CNC router, that should come in really handy. But as I was walking down the aisle getting ready to go check out for this, I ran into a display that had this and I thought man I know I need a new uh, cordless drill anyway because my DeWalt uh, you know has had a good life but it's a, the two batteries on that are, are pretty well shot and it doesn't really work anymore so I ran across this 
And this is the Porter Cable 18 volt uh, four tool system. You get the uh, cordless drill, uh, drill driver, I guess I should call it. A little, um, uh, little flashlight down here. You got a battery powered circular saw and also a reciprocating saw, which I don't have, so that, that'll come in handy. And this was like 149 bucks. Uh, I don't know if this is something they're discontinuing or what. I don't know why it was so cheap. Uh, you know, it was on sale, but I've since looked on Amazon. Uh, and these things are running for over 200 bucks, or maybe the cheapest I saw was 199 or something. But this was on sale at my local Lowe's at 149 So now I've got some cool tools I can use to finish up some of these projects that I've got sitting around, kind of half done. So anyway, just wanted to share that with you. The other thing I might mention, I was talking about the, the deal at uh, Ace Hardware, that was like 69 bucks, and I looked on uh, Amazon and, and different places too, and those things, cheapest I found was 100 bucks. so I feel like I got a good deal on that. Hopefully it will work for uh, the desk collection uh, that I want to use it for, so, and again, if you have any comments about that, uh, whether it'll work or not, uh, please let me know, or any tips you can give me on putting a desk collection system in uh, my shop, I'd sure appreciate it. So anyway, I'm going to get uh, started on another video, uh, finishing up this uh, drum sander. So uh, I'll go ahead and get this one uploaded. Uh, thanks for all the new subscribers. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do. Uh, and you'll see, uh, you know, every couple of weeks or so, you'll see some new project. And as always, anything that I uh, make, I usually draw up plans and I offer them on my website uh, totally free. So anybody that wants to get free plans and you know, feel free to modify it, make it your own, but uh, they're always up there on the website. So again, thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you next time.